In this video, we ask, we ask a lot of the time about how to calibrate an anemometer. You can see in this arm, this is facing south, or you can face it north. It all depends on how the tip is calibrated. So in this instance, we're gonna face this arm south, so it's not near a rain collector or anything, so it's got free area, but we're gonna face the brass tip north. What I usually do is get a piece of tape and tape it still. as it's impossible to calibrate a moving target. Now that's tape still, so it's not going anywhere. And we can go back to our console and calibrate that with the 180 or 360 degree offset. Same for facing it north, if it is on a separate pole and you've got it the other way, you can just spin it around, get that facing north, and I tape that there. So it's stuck there. And go back to your console and tape that all within the app in Weatherlink Live and you can calibrate the direction. Okay, calibrating the wind on the console, it's facing north. As you can see, the black tip's facing north. If it's facing the opposite direction, so south. When we're, when we're trying to calibrate the unit, all we need to do is get the wind in degrees. So we select on here, wind and it's at two degrees. To set it, hit second, hold down the alarm button, which is set. You'll see it flash three times. Now, we can use these to toggle. So we know at 360 is north. Using plus, minus, up and down, you can get through. Once you get your 360 calibrated in, just press the done button. And that's calibrated.